up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. Well, the crowd pops as this guy makes the walk to the octagon, and you can see why if you've watched film on him. This is a true mixed martial artist, plus skills in all areas, and figures to be a handful, really, for anybody in this division. Probably comfortable tonight anywhere the fight goes. Truly a well-rounded MMA fighter. You know, we, we, we trot that term out there a lot. This guy fits the bill. This guy is a very well-rounded fighter. You never know what he's gonna do. His striking is world-class, his ground game is excellent, and he mixes them up very well. So here is Conor McGregor making the walk once again, and absolutely remarkable what he has accomplished since making his UFC debut in 2013. Still the only simultaneous two-division UFC champion the promotion has ever seen. That left hand, whether you're a featherweight or a welterweight, you don't want to get hit with the left hand of Conor McGregor. He is precise, a creative striker who has certainly put Dublin, Ireland, and SBG Ireland on the MMA map. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan-favorite combination. for this welterweight fight. So two years, the gap in age, some differences in height and reach as well. And now one more time for the official introductions. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC walkaway division. It's a This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer and jiu-jitsu fighter, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Huntington Beach, California, USA, Bazooka. And now he his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding really professional record of 21 wins, three losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the notorious Connor McGregor! All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right go, now. Run, I'm very run, excited. Run, run. Let's go. We're underway. So here is Conor McGregor once again. Is there any atmosphere in MMA quite like Conor McGregor fighting in this octagon? The Irish fans are going bananas. We'll see if Conor McGregor can take advantage of what is an obvious edge in reach here tonight. That was a nice jab. Joe, how does he approach this particular challenge tonight? One thing to look out for in this fight are the counter shots of Conor McGregor. Oh! Lands a big right hand early. Hard oh. left hand. Oh. Huge right hand!
And here's the end of the fight. Let's take a look at that again. Check out this angle here. Boom! And then he's out. And there he is after a massive knockout here tonight. Near perfect execution and a seminal moment for him here in the Octagon tonight. The official decision Ladies is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Mario Yamasaki's called a stop to this contest. At one minute, four seconds to the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, the notorious We're getting used to saying it. Conor McGregor, your winner yet again as he continues what has been one of the most remarkable legacies in UFC history. And when the lights are at their brightest, as they were here tonight, the notorious Conor McGregor seems to come through with one of his vintage performances. A huge win for Conor McGregor on the big stage here tonight.